So the people are lower than any of them. And another thing too is the, the official kick out the door. Okay. All right. I have to put on some glasses. Thank you, Warren, for passing our ball because I can't see two feet in front of me reading these small print letter. And you look marvelous. And we'd like to get a round of applause to Laura for getting it all together. And Jeannie and didn't try to run it. I'm glad she, did. she had this here because I didn't want to have a barbecue in my house again because it takes a lot of clean up with all you wild I know. Out there. <laughs> thank, you. thank you again, Mara, for, uh, for all this. <laughs> have you seen okay, my I'm YouTube gonna, one? Because I can't read two feet in front of me. I'm going to read this off a little bit. Tom and Janine both started yeah. counting transit in 1986. Jeannie, I said Jeannie. No, Barbara. Can you let a shot of tequila, please. Thank you. All right. Barbara. Huh? Ooh. I just ordered another tequila. Okay. Tom at Cerrone and Jenny. That's your boy, huh? In January 2007, Tom moved to the South Yard. Yeah. I don't know how the hell you got back to the South Yard because I've been trying for years and I never got there. Hey, big clown, sir. You can go now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, all right. We'll talk later. Okay. Okay. And then from Shaboya to 1988 to 1989. You just can't stay still, huh? You have to just move over all over the place. That's you. Okay. Then back to South Yard again. When they kicked out of Shaboya? Yeah. Okay. That's my <laughs> uh, from South Yard from 1989 to 1992. And then back to Shaboya 1992. Now I know they kicked you out of South Yard. Right? Well, they closed it down because I was there. <laughs> oh. Okay. The lady <laughs> and Tom met in November of 1983 while having a conversation with a co worker. What co worker was it? 93. I it was says, much too young in 83. That's the 83? Sorry about that. 93. No, 83. Oh, well, well, what's one year? Okay. So, who the co cool worker was? Who don't know who the co cool worker was? Sam, Ar Sam Armandera. No, it wasn't. It was, it was, it was Robert York. That's our year. And this is how their marriage began. Okay. Barumba. But they really talk until April 1994. I wonder why. While doing dial-a-right. Dial-a-right? You know, you guys are telling your age about that. Nobody else knows what this is. Dial-a-right after I did it. See, nobody knows what it is. Dial-a-right. This is when you make a phone call, you got a bus. Well, quit telling your age, right? Okay, we don't want to know. Okay. So, there's a few over there that were in there driving when Dial Ride was throughout the whole county. Yeah. Yes. Right? Yeah. Hey, you know what? We won't talk to them. Maureen and Tony and I don't talk about this stuff, all right? Yeah. All right. Okay, back to this. All right. But the lady here was mad about having to drive the sedan to make a relief in San Martin. Anybody knows where San Martin is? South County? Yeah, it's over that right. way. So she parked the relief vehicle in the middle of a large mud puddle. <laughs> That's her. That's her. Every time she made release, whoever had to drive back, usually it was Tom, had the unpleasant task of wading through the mud to get the car. He had that sinking feeling ever since. <laughs> and fall of 1994, they started dating. Whoa. They were married on October 19th of 1996. Let's give a round of applause. I did not write. I'm just reading the script here, so do not, I do, don't hold me towards this. After years of gagging, from the and after particularly miserable Friday the 13th, oh yeah, in the summer of 1999, they decided to make the switch to light rail. <laughs> yeah, thank you. Okay. Then shortly, Jimmy and hit two FBI agents on First Street. Oh, I remember that. Yeah! This was set the stage for the resurrection of the light rail. We all know about that. Really? Yeah. A little more than three years later, in almost the same spot, she had another tragic accident in the car. 917. Oh. Except A is Christine. 
Christine. This is the same car that was involved with weather accidents in winter and spring of 2007. Once hitting the pedal drive, and we all know who that driver and operator was. Hey, wait a minute. The judge hit yeah. us. We didn't hit him. Okay, step correct. You know who hit him, all right? So, you got that part. And then another, then a bicycle by Lockheed. Same operator. Yes. Go figure. Same car. Okay. Government issue. On August 2nd, 2007, the lady was operating car 917 and hit a police officer in almost the same spot, which led to the famous exorcism of car 917. On August 2nd, 2007, and thankfully Tom has a perfect safety record. Go figure. <laughs> Okay, wait, 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 the wait, 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 the wait, 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 Hi. And it says on the bottom, called the Blessed One. Are we ready? We're ready. Solomillo, the Malamali, Oh God, that's, that's Islamic. Amen. We now bless the car. Come up to the front. Uh, and no nagging, Jamie. No nagging. You guys did that good. From the operators, and this is tradition uh, we, that we kind of started about 10 years ago. And we would have had two, but they said a cut of cutbacks. No way. We got down to one. I was living in mine. I bought it at the play market. I want to do saying from Dean Pomquist and from the training department, they did uh, give up one best oh, issue. On. So, Jeez. no, I went through all the departments. To tell you the truth, I went through all the departments. Lighting, uh, the training department was the only one that said, you know what? Here's a best. Take it. And we all signed it. This is there's, there's plenty of dispatch. Okay, really? Come on, TWP. Come on, there you go. There you go. That's all right. Yeah, this is the one I stole. I just turned it back in. Go figure. Okay, this is why we got it. So. Yeah. I stole, right. I stole two, and I, I turned them back in at the very end of my career. <laughs> very, very fashionable. But you could tell us what I stole because it fits. They're wearing it in Milan nowadays. Look where that happy okay. face is. It's almost right. <laughs> we're not, it's, we're not hey, Gary, Gary, it's, it's right. <laughs> this is from the division of my rail. This is from... Uh, Gary couldn't be here tonight, uh, so he asked me to uh, send out to an MC to, uh, to give you the traditional plaque. This is what we call a slice of rail. We played on it, so it says Barbara, Canatcher Badge 2914, Coach Operator, Light Rail Operator, in recognition of 23 years of dedicated service from April 28th. Let her go. Oh, that was for your safety. <laughs> Wait a minute. Well, hold the people. plaque. I want some cake. Oh, okay, 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 okay. oh, just kidding. From April 28th, 1986 to September 30th, 2009. Keep on smiling. Best of luck. We will miss you from all your friends and staff of, at BTA Light Road Division. Yay! Yeah. Speech. Oh, not yet. 
Well, by the way, they didn't forget the other half. Oh, the better half. <laughs> oh. You're brave, Tom.